in this video we're going to find the length of a line segment so the distance between two three and five seven so how long is that line how far do you have to go to travel from two three to five seven this is actually a pythagoras question so what we've got to do is we've got to work out we'll turn it into a right angle triangle so this becomes the hypotenuse that's what we're working out so we've got to look at the difference here the difference here and use pythagoras for this so between two and five how far have we gone along the x so between two and five how far have we gone we've gone three along two to five is three and from three to seven that's four up so we've gone three along and four up and then we just do Pythagoras so a squared plus b squared equals c squared so three squared plus four squared is x squared nine plus sixteen is x squared twenty five is x squared x is the square root of twenty five which is five so the distance between these two points is five so if we do the same thing again it doesn't matter if it's going to go down in this case it is um, the only thing that really matters is the distance between the x's and the distance between the y's so if I draw, i'll draw it accurately if i if i can so five eight here and then along to eight minus one so let's go there so it's going to go it's going to go down this time um but that doesn't really matter so five to eight how far have we gone along the x? 5 to 8, that's 3. 8 to minus 1, that's a difference of 9. It's gone down 9. So 9 and x. And then it's just a Pythagoras question again. So a squared plus b squared equals c squared. 3 squared plus 9 squared is x squared. 9 plus 81 is x squared. So 90 is x squared, and x is the square root of 90. We'll leave it. We'll leave it as a square root of 90 before. Uh, for now, sorry. This will simplify um, into well, 3 root 10, but uh, we'll leave it. Square root 90 is fine. Square root 90. Okay, so see if you can ever get these questions. Pause the video. Okay, the first one, the difference between the x's is just 1. And the difference between the y's is 6. So 1 squared plus 6 squared equals our distance. 1 squared is 1. 6 squared is 36. Equals x squared. So that's 37. So x is the square root of 37. We'll leave it in that form. Difference between the x's here, 3. Difference between the y's is 8. From 3 to minus 5, you go down 8. So 3 squared plus 8 squared equals x squared. 9 plus 64 is x squared. So that's 73, which is x squared, which means x is root 73 for the second one. Find the difference between... Distance between... Oh! So... <laughs> Both of the x's is as um, four. So if we're following, we'll follow the same process. Um, so it's going to give us zero squared plus five squared equals x squared. So five squared equals x squared. X is just five. So imagine we've got four three here, four minus two here. The difference is just five. It's just in a vertical line. So 4, 3, 4 minus 2. It's a vertical line. The difference is just 5. 